Hello everyone, in this video we're going to be looking at the first question from January 2nd, 21 Hacker at a chessboard. Okay, so the question is, in this version of chess, two kings are placed on the chessboard and the coordinates of the first king are generated, so x1, y1 is the coordinate of the first king. And then it is placed on the chessboard. Now, coordinates of the second king is generated, x2, y2. Then it is placed on that generated position. Okay. Now these pieces can be moved in a sequential manner that is one by one. So like first will move, then second will move and now first one will move again, right? So now like that one by one they'll move and both the kings want to win. So it's like a simple game of chess, but there's only two kings. Okay. Now the rules are given. So the chessboard is eight by eight board. Kings can move from one cell to another if they have an edge, in, edge or corner in common like the normal uh, king does in chess. Now, if the generated coordinates of the second king are exactly equal to the first, then the second king wins. How is that? Because suppose you have a block and then the first king is placed there. Now, the second king's generated block is the same itself. So, second king strikes the first king. So, this rule is one a little bit important. So, if the generated coordinates of the second king are exactly equal to the first, the second king wins. Both players play optimally, meaning that both of them want to win. And the game is considered to be won by the first king piece. If after it moves, then it can have the same coordinates as the second. So what does that mean? I'll just explain it to you. Okay. So this question is very easy. However, it's a bit tricky. It's a bit tricky to understand. Okay. So whenever you get a question like this, try to visualize it or try to work it out on a piece of paper. So here I have uh, a chessboard. You not you need not make the whole thing, but uh, this you get the idea, right? So suppose that the first king's generated uh, coordinates is here. So here's the first king. Now then the second king's generated coordinates is there. Okay, so first and the second. Now, first king wants to win, it's first king's turn, right? So first king will be generated, then the second king's coordinate will be generated, now the turn of first king. So simply the first king can come from over here to over there and the first king will win, right? So this is one scenario. That is also the first test case, if you look at it. So let's look at the first test case. So these are the generated output, two test cases are there. So first king's output is 1, 1, second king's output is 2, 2. So let's say that the numbering is like this, you know, uh, this is 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, this is 6, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, okay. So 1, 1, the first king generated output, generated coordinate is here, second king's generated coordinate is here. Now, first king's turn, first king can simply come from over here to over there, and take over the second king. So first king wins, right? What is the second test case? Second test case is 1, 3, 8, 8. So where will 1, 3 be? 1, 3 will be something like here, okay? And 8, 8 will be somewhere along here, right? At the end. Now, it is a draw. Why is it a draw? Now just think carefully. Both of them want to win. Right now it is the first king's turn. So the first king wants to approach the second king because the first king wants to take over the second king. But the second king has an like has space to move, right? So the second king can move anywhere. Or let's imagine it like this. So suppose the first king is over here. Okay. And now what? And now first king is over here. Second king is over here. Now it's first king's turn. So if first king goes over here, second king will kill it, right? If first king goes over here, second king will kill it, right? So first king will simply move away from the board, right? And now it's a draw. Why? Because second king, if it moves here, then first king can move here. Basically, there's no checkmate. Both of them has enough space so that they can move without losing. So what does that mean? So this simply means that suppose first king is over here, second king is over here. This is, these are the generated coordinates. What will happen? First king will take over the second king. It will win, right? Now let's take another scenario. Suppose first king is over here, second king is over here. These are the generated First king is over here, second king is over here. These are the generated coordinates. Again, what will happen? First king's turn, first king will win by simply taking over the second king. So this gives us some condition. Let's note those conditions. Now the first obvious condition is given in the question that if the coordinates are equal, if the generated coordinates, I'll say, if the generated coordinates are equal, then second king wins, right? Second king wins. So this is given in the question. So you can just check the input. If generated coordinates are equal, then the second king wins. Now, how will the first king wins? So again, let's look at another example. If the second king is over here, 
then first king will take over right second king is over here first king will take over or second king is over here first king will take over that means that if the second king generated uh, output or generated coordinate is in adjacent to the first king generated coordinate then the first king will win so let's write that down as well so if the generated coordinates generated coordinates of second king is adjacent to generated coordinate of first king then first king wins because right now it's first king's uh, turn right so first king wins pretty simple okay now when will it be a draw so i say any condition other than this will be a draw why so let's see so we just covered if first king is here and second king is in adjacent to the first king now suppose second king is anywhere but in adjacent to the uh, second king first king so here is second king second king is not adjacent to the first king right what will it be it's a draw how because see if second king moves here then the first king will kill it but both of them want to win if first king comes here then second kill second king will take over it but both of them want to win so none of them will make a move so that they lose so first king will move anywhere but here second king will move anywhere but here and they'll just move away from each other and no one will win right so no one will give the other one chance to win so else if anything but this then it's a draw quite simple okay so again the scenario is this if the generated coordinates are equal meaning that the first king is here and now the second king is also coming here so obviously the second king is taking over the first king so the second king is winning now if the generated coordinate of the second king is adjacent then simply it's first king's turn it will take over the second king's position and first king will win like but if it is not adjacent then none of them can win both of them will not give each other the chance to win so it will just go on and on and on and it will just be a simple draw so that is the question so this being said now let's just move to the code itself code being very simple okay so in the code i've done nothing there's just test cases while tc minus minus x1 y1 first king's position x2 y2 second king's position now this is just the condition for checking adjacency so this condition is simply if second king second king is adjacent so if second king is adjacent then it is first otherwise if same coordinates so this is the condition if same coordinates and otherwise anything else will just be a draw so this is the code which gets accepted so let's just submit it and see once and it gets accepted so that's it it was a tricky question but the only thing we had to see was that the second king will only win if the generated coordinates are equal otherwise if they are adjacent first king will win otherwise it will always be a draw so that's all guys if you have any doubts just put them in the comments thank you